YouTube I'm back with another video um seems like forever it has been forever I haven't done one since before Christmas because I was absolutely manic and then the girlfriend moved in um don't know what else is new I've got an Xbox one but grudgingly um had to get into a console because she doesn't like playing on the PC even though you can play it with an Xbox one controller go figure and then you're probably wondering what this is well this is the PC because this is what this um video is about this is how to spray paint a PC part two um and this is my front panel um and also the side I'll show you a little bit of the side because remember, anyone that's watching, it was uh, gloss white. I went back to satin white. But um, I just wanted to go through um, how I sprayed my front panel. Now, I'm not going to show you any spraying in this today because I already did one where I was just showing you about priming and how many layers and coats you need to do. So for this and the window, I'm just going to show you a few tips, things that I've come into. Every PC case is different. So if you're doing it, then you know everything might make sense. None of it will make sense. So um, this is what I was going for. This was the prototype, which was all black. Um, and this hasn't had any change other than I just put some primer on this. That was the original what I did just to make it look cool, 20 quid case, and I went, oh, oh, I want to build something nice. So what we're going for is a gloss black. This is going to be all in gloss black, um, and this is a satin white. I didn't like the gloss white. It just looked had this yellowy colour to it, so I've got rid of it. Um, and also what I've done as well on the back, so I've got all this cable clutter. It's quite a small case, so the only thing I've kept is the USB 3. I've chopped these cables off, um, and just the power switch. I haven't got a reset switch, um, and I haven't got a power LED indicator as well, um, because I'm putting a window on it so I can see if it's on. Um, and I can hear if it's on. So I'm going to take you in for a closer look, um, show you what I've done, and then we will unleash the beast. So as I mentioned earlier in the video, um, I have sort of skipped a few steps. So I've already took everything off the uh, front panel, and we're going to talk about that um, throughout this as well. Um, and I've already sprayed it in primer as well. So one of the first things I'm going to get to as well, these are already the final done. Um, you, they look white when you've seen them earlier with the computer on my desk, but these were originally black. And these are the front sort of USB sort of strips. Um, what I didn't do on the first one was actually remove all the residue left over from the sticker and then put some tape in there so you can um so it gives a much uh, nicer flush finish as well so if you take anything out from the front any little stickers or anything you're going to want to tape inside um, make sure you've done a nice job and then you can just if you just press the I used electrical tape press it in there and then just score around the edges with a Stanley knife you also want to do the same with the switches as well inside the switches um, and this is really important because obviously a lot of switches here's um, the power switch will um, finish quite flush so what I've done is as well when I did these sw switches as you can see there's some blue tack this is pink tack um, and I taped up the sides as well so then this is going to have a real nice flush finish when I put it in so there's some really good things to note there hopefully this can help you out if you're planning to do it um, and then also regarding the front grill which is also already finished in this new satin white well old satin white then I got rid of it then new satin white again um, so that will fit in there one thing I want to mention about these if you take out any front grills and they've got like these sort of metal tabs on them you really want to keep down the amount of times you're going to take this out and put it back in because on the other one, one of these has already snapped. And the reason I had to keep taking it out was because this is something you may find with your case. It came with this, this really horrible dust filter. Um, so I'm going to remove that completely. That's not going back in. And what I've bought is, I said this in the other video that you could get 10 for three pounds. Yes, you can if you want to wait a month for them to come from China. Um, these are actually one pound fifty each on eBay, and these are some nice dust filters. So that will help you out. Um, is there anything else? No power switches, no cable. If you can't take your grill out, you're just going to have to tape it up um, and do a really nice job. So now I'm going to get this primed, um, not primed, I'm going to get this sprayed in the nice gloss black. Um, I'm going to put it all back together and then show you it on the case. Okay, so those tips made absolutely perfect sense, or they didn't make any sense at all. I'm sorry if they didn't make any sense at all. And if they have, and you're going on to uh, make your own case um, and do your own little mod, um, I hope it goes really well for you. So let's get these. I haven't even got a nice sheet to put on it, like something glossy. I've just got pillowcases. And there it is. So I've got all the white, and I've got the black. Oh, I'm really happy with it. The gloss black, I've got on the gloss black on the top as well. Just looks really nice with the satin white. The gloss white and gloss black just didn't work together. Um, only real issues is, again, switches. The switches are so hard. Um, I would say when you paint your switch and all this is dry, I'd leave your switch for a day, good day and a half. Really thin coats because it's just... 
if you poke it like that, if you've got fingernails or something and you're poking it, um, you're going to like mark it and stuff. So it's got a couple of marks in it. I've been trying to clean it. But other than that, I'm really happy with it so far. I think it looks absolutely beautiful. Um, anyone that's seen the original uh, CIT barricade sort of video that I did, you'll see how long, it, how much it's come across. And the next one will be in the next few weeks will be, um, I'm going to show you the window. I'm not going to show you from this side at the moment because I've put loads of mods on the inside, which you'll see when you see the window. And the only way you can see that um, is if you come back to my channel and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.